options and today I'm going to teach you how to get high quality XVID uh, rendering settings. So yeah, I've got my clip here, some velocity and nice looking colors. Things look pretty nice um, Yeah. So you start off by go to file and uh, properties. The template should be HDV 720p. Uh, full resolution rendering quality should be best. And these other settings should be fine. Yeah, make sure it looks like this, but it should be fine from the default. And uh, go to audio. Choose a resample and strict stretch quality. Should be best. Um, uh, here you can choose if it wants to round or stereo. I prefer stereo, but just it's up to you. You know, press apply. Um, okay. Sorry for that. Wait, wait. Me. Um, render as. Uh, type the name of your clip. I'll type tutorial. Video for Windows, AVI, make sure it's AVI. And uh, default template, uncompressed. Yeah, press custom. Uh, yeah. Uh, video rendering quality should be best. Go to video. HDV 720. Um, the resolution should be uh, 1280x720. That's good. That's alright. Uh, frame rate 29.970 that's right uh, non progressive scan yeah then you go to video format and you gotta choose xvid mpeg4 codec if you don't have it I'll put the link in the description so you can download it and just install it then it should be in this list you know alright press configure um, it's gonna look like this when you're done with it. That's not good. So you press target quantizer and go to 10,000. Make sure it's 10,000. Right. Go to more, uh, ultra high, and turbo. That's really important. It makes the quality a lot better. So turbo. Um, seven options: grayscale, grayscale encoding. And chroma optimize, optimizer enabled. Make sure this locked. It's okay. Okay. And uh, audio. That's all right already. So save your template as yeah your render settings. Hey HQ render settings. Xvid. Yeah. Save. You should be here. Template. Yeah, that's it. Just save it. Have fun. And remember to subscribe. Bye.